What's up guys, it's Instinct here and welcome to my brand new series called Quick Tips. Now in this series, I'll be showing you guys a bunch of quick little tips and tricks in Cinema 4D. So with all that being said, let's get started. Alright, so episode number one, we are going to be focusing on materials. More specifically, I'll be showing you guys how to do this. So basically, it is a grid effect on your materials and I'll be showing you guys how to improve your materials and some cool little things you guys can do with your materials. Alright, so what you guys want to do is you guys want to go ahead and grab a metal material. It can work with any material, but it just works best with metal material. So I'm going to be using this metal material like so. Drop it on, hit uh, cubic and check seamless, and then hold control and move it down to any other layers that you guys want to use. Alright, so now you guys have this done. Now what you guys want to do is go ahead to the uh, top layer here. And as you guys can see, it, if uh, offset U moves it left to right and offset V moves it up and down. So you guys can kind of position that however you guys want to. I'm just going to leave that default. Now what you guys can do is go to length U and uh, go ahead and put this at 1%. And as you guys can see, there's a little bit of a grid effect there. And then go to length V, click 1% and there's another grid effect right there if you guys go ahead and hold down right here go to render region you guys can go ahead and select this little area and as you guys can see there is this cool little grid effect here now you guys can mess around with all the positionings and get some really good effects so that's pretty much it for this quick tip tutorial if you guys like the series then please make sure to drop a big fat like comment and subscribe and i'll see you in the next video guys peace